Hello and welcome to Ergon Web Ergon Reviews, where we tell you the facts, not fluff. My name is Rick Utzler, and guess what? It's still really hot here in Lake Havasu City. But we're not going to let that stop us from getting to our next Ergon Review. Today we're going to take a look at the Dan Weston pellet revolver with a 2.5 inch rifled barrel. Arguably, this is one of the most realistic replicas that I've had the pleasure to work with. Let's get started. So the bottom line is that I've been drooling over this pistol for some time. The photos online simply don't do this piece justice. Now I love revolvers. I own several and this could sit right next to any of them and you'd not know it was an air gun without really close inspection. The size, weight, feel, and build quality is far above what I expected in something at this price point. This revolver operates on a single CO2 cartridge that's installed in the grip of the gun. Removing the grip plate, which is a synthetic grip that's integrated into a cast metal plate, is quite heavy and holds the Allen wrench used to puncture the CO2. Again, the feel of these components is far beyond what I expected. The revolver has the exact same cylinder release as my old Dan Wesson. Once opened, you can remove the shells and begin the loading process. Just place in your favorite lead-free or light lead pellet into the rear of the shells and return them into the cylinder. Once closed, you're ready to go. Now the Dan Wesson operates in both double action and single action, but the trigger pull in double action is really hard. Nothing unexpected in a revolver like this, however. The single pull is not bad, sitting at between about 5.5 and, and 6 pounds, give or take a little bit. Now the open sights are very easy to use, and the rear sight is fully adjustable. Lastly, and I really like the way they did this, there's a manual safety hidden behind the hammer. First things first, let's go ahead and talk about the target audience for this product. It's going to be those that like ultra-realistic replica revolvers, and those shooters that are looking for a very realistic training aid. When you match the revolver to the ASG molded holster, you've got a really nice combo. Now the two and a half inch barrel delivers really decent accuracy at 15 feet. When you try and back up to 30 feet, things tend to open up a little bit. You're still more than 10 can accurate, but it's not gonna be a 10 meter target gun by any stretch. Actual performance is very close to stated performance with light lead pellets like the RWS Hobby pellets. They averaged about 320 feet per second off of fresh CO2. That's only about 24 feet per second off the max rated velocity. When I switch over to the H&N Match Green pellets, I get over 400 feet per second, provided I don't try and shoot too quickly. You see, as you rapid fire a CO2, the CO2 freezes, and you're going to lose a lot of velocity. So the best way to stay really consistent is give that CO2 time to recover between each shot. Now on paper, the shot count is about 90 shots per CO2, and I'm inclined to believe it, because I frankly lost count after I reloaded 9 or 10 times. Accuracy at the 15 foot mark is pretty darn good. I can generally put all my shots in a nice little group simply just holding freehand. The key to consistency, again, if you want that consistent accuracy, give the CO2 time to recover before taking your next shot. Seeing that I'm using this for training and practice here in my garage, 15 feet accuracy is just what I need. Without a doubt, it was definitely worth the wait for me to finally get my hands on this great revolver. The build quality is exceptional. The look, feel, and overall realism just really impressed me. I'm pleased with just about everything this product has to offer, except I do wish that double action trigger pull was a little bit lighter. But as I take a step back and I really look at it, you know it's pretty par for the course for a big heavy revolver like this to have a heavy double action trigger pull. You switch to single action and it's perfectly fine. So absolutely one sweet revolver. I'd like to take a moment to thank Pyramid Air for sponsoring Airgun Web in these videos. When you're looking for your next air gun or you're looking to buy your next batch of air gun supplies, please do so over at www.pyramidair.com. Please be sure to let them know that Rick sent you their way. And when you're looking for real-world Airgun reviews, come here to Airgun Web, where we're going to tell you the facts, not fluff. For now, my name is Rick Utzer with Airgun Web. Thanks for watching.